What is tax law selling? It's the ultimate answer to the question, why is the market down? In other words, everyone sees the market at the end of the year go down. And you may notice that the worst performing coins or the worst performing stocks are going down the most. Like for example, at the end of 2022, Tesla was going down 10% per day. And today, when this video was recorded, things like Solana and Avalanche and Polkadot were all down five to 10% early in the morning. So what's up with that? Well, before I tell you, make sure to subscribe to this channel. Turn on alerts so you know when we're posting videos or going live. And if the content works for you, hit the like button, share the video and leave a comment. Now, back to the market. What is tax law selling? Well, here's what big players do. If you got an airdrop that went from a dollar to five dollars and then you took the profit and then you had another investment that turned around like Solana and went from forty dollars to nine dollars, you could take the profit and report that as income, but then you could take the loss from the coin that was down and offset that income. So you may have a gain in one area, right? But you could realize a loss in another, right? So your gain minus your loss may wind up being zero. Or your gain minus your loss may wind up reducing how much capital gains tax you have to pay. So you're like, oh, okay, Bill, well, thanks for the tax lesson. But what does this have to do with the market? Well, in the last days of any year, and even in the first days of a new year, you can see the coins that perform the worst perform even more horrible, right? The declines can get, you know, worse and worse and worse because the lower prices go, get this, there's no incentive to buy when it comes to tax law selling. The lower it goes, the more tax law sellers go, well, you know, gee, I lost money, but the lower it goes, the bigger the write-off I get. So more selling and lower prices at the end of a year doesn't necessarily bring in buyers. In many cases, it actually brings in more sellers because sellers go, in quotes, oh goody, look at the loss I can take. I can realize and say, okay, I can take a loss. It got worse and worse. So now my big loss can offset my big gains. And that's tax loss selling and a good explanation for why crypto is down.